I'm Alec Haloka, the co-creator of Aquaria. I made the game with Derek Yu over the course of two years. Derek did the art, and I did the programming and the music. Aquaria is an underwater exploration game. You're exploring this huge fantasy world, and everything in it is just full of content. You play as Nyjah, who's this strange underwater creature, and she doesn't remember how she came to be where she is. So the story is about her trying to uncover her memories. So you start off just by exploring the waters around you and eventually you start discovering these dark secrets and unraveling the mystery behind why Aquaria is there and why it is the way it is. And now we're collaborating with Andrew Church, who's a really cool programmer from Japan. He made his own PSP version of Aquaria, and I was really, really impressed with that because the PSP is not a very powerful device, and somehow he managed to get the game to run on it. So I asked him if he'd be interested in working on Aquaria for iPad, and he said yes. So Andrew went through the game and basically optimized everything he could to try and squeeze every last ounce of performance out of the iPad 1. And then once the iPad 2 came out, the game was running so fast that it just ran beautifully on that device. The iPad version of Aquaria is different in a few ways. It has a number of gameplay improvements. Of course, the major thing is that it's now touch control. We've made changes to the gameplay to make the game more accessible for casual players without trying to take away from the mystery and the excitement of the game. The mini-map now displays your progress through an area so you can tell which areas you haven't explored yet. There's a bunch of other subtle changes that hopefully will make the game easier to pick up and play. Aquaria first came out in 2007, so the audience for the game has kind of been growing over the course of a couple years. But I think there's still a huge untapped audience for Aquaria, and so this seems to be the next logical step is to bring Aquaria to a device where it's more accessible and easier for people to get immersed into the game. I don't think there are too many games on the iPad right now that are this big in scope. This game can take up to 26 hours to play through everything and find every single secret. And I think for players who have played it, they're going to discover the game in a new way. The game feels very different, and it kind of feels better than all the other versions because of all the improvements we've made, but also because of the controls and just how intimate it is to play the game on this device. And I think that's a really neat thing. I think there's just a whole world that you can explore through your iPad.